Welcome to my first voiceover video. Today we got the Zealous Racing League race at Donington. Uh, basically this race, uh, the only thing that this race didn't have was a dumpster fire. Let's get into it. Alrighty, here we go. Start of the race here. We're starting uh, P20 out of 24 cars. We didn't qualify for this race. Here we go. We're going to go into the first corner. We're going to take it a little bit easy just in case there's uh, any crashes up ahead. Coming around the first corner, looking ahead. Looks like everybody made it so far. We're pushing, pushing to get right by the outside of Paulus here. Coming down, going into the what they call the old hairpin. Big crash up ahead, huge crash, huge crash. Car up on his lid, oh geez, oh, and the C parts for us. Now we're coming up on Alberts. We had to back off a little bit. Now there's Sherpenberry in the way. Don't I don't really know where the heck I'm supposed to go here. Hoping that any one of those guys makes a mistake so I can get a run on them coming out of this corner here. And there's the mistake I'm looking for. Breaking into the corner, coming around. Just pushing, pushing, pushing. Hopefully that somebody else makes a mistake here. I'm going to go and I'm going to try to send it right here. Probably not the best send in the world, but I was desperate. Oh, no. Good thing that we both came out of that alive. Looking up ahead, things are getting a little bit spicy coming into uh, the first hairpin here. Everyone coming around. Everyone makes it. Sherberry's a little bit wide trying to get the run. Alberts is a little bit slow. Sherberry gets up beside Alberts. Going around the next hairpin goes a little bit wide. I get the run on Alberts here, but I uh, get bogged down a little bit because Sherberry screwed up the exit. Trying to go three wide, probably not the best idea, so I back off. Coming around here, big mistakes coming up. Trying to push, 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 trying to get up beside Sherpenberry. Looks looking pretty good here, got a very, very good exit there. Coming around, felt like it was locked in. And then Sherpenberry goes for the dive, and he loses it, takes me right back out. And we were already up to P13 in one lap. And now I'm trying to regain trying to uh, get back on the racetrack without killing anybody else and basically almost having to start all over here comes uh, Glenn Pino on the inside I leave him a little bit of room I'm able to uh, uh, keep that uh, position from him coming up through the corner here trying to catch right back up to this gaggle of cars we're pushing 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 losing a little bit on the exit there hoping that I can regain back through the uh, uh, Oh, and there goes Beaudry on Dykstra, on the Lenny, hoping that one of these two makes a mistake here so I can slip on by. Oh, and there it is. Beaudry goes a little bit wide. I get the run on the exit, but he able he's able to get a little better run still. Coming up on the outside of Beaudry, hoping that I can still stay in there. Get squeezed a little bit. Coming around the first turn again. Oh, he loses a little bit. And I'm pushing on the outside, a little bit on the gravel. See if I can hold it. Come on, come on, let's go. Oh, oh. All right, now we're gonna try to over under him here. He's probably gonna end up going wide, and there he goes, wide. Oh, and then I ended up writing him, and I'm the one who got screwed. Trying to rejoin safely again, getting passed by all the cars that we just passed. Right back, actually we're worse off now than when we actually started the race. We're back to uh, 22nd spot. Now we have uh, Reed in front of us. Seeing if any of these cars make a, make a mistake. Coming through. Going through the hairpin. Oh, oh, oh! Fender loses it! And we're back to where we started again. Actually, we're almost, uh, we're actually 23rd now. All right, now we got Dale Rodman Jr. in front of us right here. Mr. Slow to Pro Racing YouTube channel. See if we can get a run on any one of these guys here. Looks like a couple of them made a mistake going through what they call the old hairpin. 
coming up, getting a decent run out of the corner, but a very difficult area to pass right here. Dale, Dale is trying to get up uh, right right behind uh, Alvarez, not, not working, not working. Trying to get a run, breaking a little bit early for the turns. Oh, big crash there, big crash between Dykstra and uh, Beaudry, I think. Oh, and there's Dale coming up beside Alvarez. Ooh, they almost touch. Hoping that one of these guys makes a mistake so that we can slip by. Coming out of the uh, chicane. I'm going to get a run here. I'm going to get a run. Can we send it? Can we send it? Uh, and coming in, coming in, coming in. Come on, power out, power out. Let's go. Come on, McLaren. Come on. And we're going to try to over-under him here. We're going to let him go. We're going to break a little bit early. Try to get the run coming onto the uh, front straightaway here. Oh, come on, McLaren. McLaren versus McLaren. Who got the better exit? Looks like I got the better exit. And it's done. We got that position. We're up to P20 again. All right, coming up to uh, Dale Rodman Jr. here. Hopefully we can get a run out of this corner and see if we can get by him there. He makes a little mistake. I make the same mistake. I still get a little better run. And he lets me go. What a nice guy. All right, coming back into the chicane. Back onto the front straightaway here. And the car is exiting the pits. Let's see how this is going to affect us. All right, looks like it's a lap car. So let's see how this plays out. Fender in front in the Lamborghini. Coming into the old hairpin here. Let's see. Hopefully he makes a mistake. I get a little better exit, a little bit of a run up the hill, but unfortunately it's not going to be enough. Very difficult to pass in this section here. I'm going to break a little bit early, hoping that he is going to overshoot the corner. Definitely got a good run here on Fender coming out. Hopefully we're going to make it through. Yes, and sent. And that's it. Up to P18. Alright, now we're coming up to both Belanger, who is going to be a lap car. Inside, JP, inside. And back to, uh, with uh, Glenn Pino, which we passed earlier, but now we have to repass because of everything that had happened. Inside, Kevin. And being the gentleman that he is, he lets us through. Now, Belanger is also one of the quicker guys in our league as well, so we're pretty much doing the same lap times right now. We have a massively damaged car. I think at this point, I think we have, I think, 15 to 18 seconds worth of damage. Car definitely does not feel good anymore, so I'm just following uh, JP. JP loses it. Oh, loses it. Here's my chance to get by. Go ahead. And yep. he lets me by. All right. And that is over and done with. All right. Now we're going to head for the pits. We're going to try to undercut. Coming in, coming in. A few moments later. All right, back on the power. Checking the mirror, make sure no one's coming. All right, and now we came out uh, because we pitted very, very early uh, compared to the leaders in this race. So now, oh, 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 coming up on Alberts again. I break early. I wasn't sure if he was going to take the racing line coming out of the pits or not. We're pushing. We're pushing so hard right now. This damaged car is definitely not helping us at all. We are roughly about a second and a half a lap slower than what we should be doing right now. But traffic and our severely damaged car is definitely hindering us at this point. But we're gonna keep trying. We got 18 minutes left on the clock. We gotta try to get past Alberts here in this orange Mercedes. Let's hope that he makes a mistake. I am absolutely on the limit here. Coming into the chicane. Can we get a run? Can we get a run? We, we, we got the run. We got the run. Going up on the inside. Can we outbreak him with the McLaren scrappy brakes? And we're side by side, side by side. Let's see who gets the better run. Push it. Come on, McLaren. Let's go, 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 go. Yes. Locked in. P16. Alrighty. 
now we are going to be chasing down Madrano and, and McSherpinberry there again. Now, if you remember from earlier, McSherpinberry is the one uh, that took us out in the old hairpin. Oh, Madrano's off. Here's our chance. Lambo's bouncing all over the front straight away. All right, let's see. We're pulling them a little bit. We're catching up maybe like two tenths a lap or so. But now Madrano and McSherpinberry are battling. Hopefully this will give us the uh, uh, edge that we need. Oh, they're battling. Oh, look at them side by side, ducking in. I am pushing absolutely to the limit here. Come on, let's go. They're battling, battling, battling. He's trying again. Madrano's trying again, McSherpinberry. McSherpinberry takes the uh, defensive line. I get an amazing exit here. And Madrano had to go a little bit wide. All right. We're pushing, we're pushing. Trying to catch the draft down this little straightaway here. Hopefully maybe we can get the run out of the chicane. Let's see. All right, we got a little bit of a run. Not really holding status quo here. But Drano goes for the defensive line. Overshoots the corner. Let's see if I can try to power out. Traction control hits. All power goes away for me. Coming into the last hairpin here before the front straightaway. He over, he overcooks it again. We're coming out, we're trying to push, but again, the McLaren is so damaged at this point, it just doesn't have what we need to get this done. Now we're gonna try to scare him into a, uh, in, in, into the corner here a little bit. I had no intention of passing, but I wanted to see if I could try to distract him a little bit. We're coming up, down through the S's once again. Going into the old hairpin. Let's see if we can get a run. Oh, there's the run there. He's, he goes wide. Can I make it stick? He lets us by. What a gentleman. All right, now we're hunting down McSherpinberry. This is the guy who basically screwed up our entire race right here. So I am going to take it a little bit easy with him. Coming down through the S's, through the old hairpin. He goes wide. We get an amazing run. I'm going to see if I can try to make it stick on the outside here. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting close. I just don't trust him. I just don't trust him. It's up until this point, he was uh, very erratic. All right, let's see if we can try to force him into a mistake here once again. coming up down down to the chicane once again we already got one track cut so we got to be careful let's try the s's one more time right down to the old hairpin oh someone's off up ahead kind of get distracted a little bit I, I ease off a little bit i probably could have kept my foot in it in hindsight now let's see if we can force mcsherpinberry into a mistake down into the chicane once again coming up to a lapped car I think he was the uh, the car in front uh, Carlos Flores I think he was the car uh, that flipped over a little bit earlier I was gonna go for the pass here but then Carlos lets us by so I back off I don't I didn't want to make it three wide but I think that was my opportunity to get past him there had uh, 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 Flores not been there coming into the last corner we got three and a half minutes left both McSherpinberry's car is extremely damaged as well. Let's see if we can get through Old Hairpin. We get the run yet again. He's a little bit wide once again. And again, we just run out of space. There just isn't enough space going up the hill here. Again, breaking a little bit early. He's taking the defensive line. Seeing if we can get a run. We don't. All right, down into the hairpin one, the first hairpin again. He's going extra defensive. I don't know why, because I was nowhere near. Coming down into the S's, into old hairpin again, seeing if he makes the same mistake. Ah, and I ended up overdriving the car there a little bit. At this point, I am awfully frustrated. All right, we're still hunting. He gets a little bit of a gap on us here, and that's basically the end of the race here. 
Alrighty, there you have it. The race is over. We finished P12 overall. We tried everything we possibly could do uh, to get by it. Uh, but anyways, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for joining. If you guys uh, like the video, uh, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, if you like what you're seeing, uh, I want you to hit that subscribe button for me. And uh, we'll see you guys on the uh, next video, next stream, uh, whenever I see you guys. Have a good one. See you later. Bye.